Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to set up Facebook Business Manager. Have you ever managed more than one page or business on Facebook? You know what a headache it can be? Switching between accounts and profiles was tedious, and having your personal account attached to the business page was burdensome. Even if you only manage one business account, getting into the page, navigating the analytics and ads, and adding additional user was very complex. Thankfully, Facebook recognized the problem and created Business Manager. Facebook Business Manager takes a lot of the headache out of managing multiple pages and can help you protect company's data. With a Facebook Business Manager, you can create separate ad accounts for every client or business you serve, pay for ads with different payment methods, and organize by objective for reporting. It's basically everything in one place. You need to have an account on Facebook before you can create an account in Facebook Business Manager. So if you don't have an account with Facebook yet, just create one. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. To create a business manager account, access Facebook Business Manager at business.facebook.com. Click the Create Account button located on the top right of the page. You will be asked to sign in to your Facebook account if you're not signed in. After you signed in, you'll be taken back to the Facebook Business Manager homepage. Click the Create Account button once more and a pop-up window will appear. It will ask you to create your Business Manager account. Type in your business name, it can be any. Then click the Continue button. Then you're in. You already have a Facebook Business Manager account, but then there are a few essential steps that we need to do before you're all set. What we need to do next is to add a page and an ad account. To add a page, click the add a page button and select what type of page it is. You can either add a page you own, add someone's page, or create a new page. Please take note that you would need to get an approval from the page admin if you add someone else's page. Since I own the page, I'll select add a page you own. Type in the page name on the field and click the add page button. If the page was added successfully, the blue icon will turn into a green check. The next thing that we need to do is to add an ad account. To add an ad account, click the add an ad account button and select the type of ad account that you have. You can either add your own ad account, add someone else, or create a new one. Since I don't have one, I'll select create a new ad account. This is just an easy setup. Just name your ad account. It can be any name that you want. Double check all the other details like the time zone and the currency and click the create ad account button. If you don't want to add another person to manage your ad account, then you can just click the skip button on the add a people window. You'll notice that there's a number on top of this window. This is already your ad account number. You will then be given a prompt that your ad account was successfully created. Click the close button to go back to the main screen. We will discuss more in creating an ad campaign on Facebook on another tutorial. And that, ladies and gentlemen, are the steps on how to set up your Facebook Business Manager. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice and on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.agency and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!